Da 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 da. Da 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 da. What we got, chat? Turned on the stream and huh? Wait, was I live when the camera was on again? Fakers laning the best in LCK when my streamer 28 is also losing in diamond when he's also 28. Bro, shut the fuck up. I'm not losing in diamond. Tyler won one chest player of the year. Here's his speech. Great, great speech. A little animation I made when a fraud has been caught. <laughs> what is this? What is that animation? <laughs> add it now. Oh, phone static. Uh, so yeah, someone can add it. Go to Reddit and make it add it. Congratulations to Nuclear Int, who is my MVP for the series. Mad Lions could not have won without you and the full skill set you put on display. This is the difference between me and you. You are the biggest dog in this industry and I'm just a humble player trying to improve and be a good asset for a team in League Legends. So before you at me and saying this, go fuck yourself first of all. Second of all, you can indeed suck my dick and we'll see each other next with some Twitter interaction. <laughs> <laughs> Holy fuck, nuke. I won't tell you to go fuck yourself today. You must be tired from fucking your team so many hours. Bedtime now, loser. Then you can dream about all those titles you're going to win in your mind. Why does Storin hate Nuke? What did Nuke do to him? Adam did a tweet. He says, good evening everyone. In view of the accusations I made against me by LCS Evie, I must be transparent with you. In his latest article, I don't agree with the accusations and in my career I've shown signs of mockery, insults and I was mostly respectful with my teammates. What prompted BDS to bench me at the end of the split was indeed a discussion that took on a certain extreme with Striker. So that's what I heard as well. The article says that... Um, the article says that Adam got benched for, quote, mocking, flaming, and displaying disrespectful behavior towards coaches and teammates and also rage-quitting scrims out of anger. So as far as I'm aware... I don't think he flamed teammates. I could be wrong. But I heard that it was because of a fight he had with Stryker over the game. Their head coach. And that was it. Like he had a, he had a fight with their head coach and then he got benched for it. Stryker is a person I particularly like and is someone who has been there in my, my career from all the beginning to where I am now. He's someone I hold in high esteem and can do so. On the other hand, this article points to my anger problems. Yes, I have anger problems. And this was the point I needed to work on the most my side of the year. I don't agree with the way the article turned out and it's really making me look like someone I'm not. It's also very important for me to apologize to BDS and to you who is tirelessly supporting us after match days. I'd also like to apologize to my teammates and to Gen X, who today gave their all to make up for my absence from the team and who made me very, very proud despite the fact that I was watching from home, sad and disappointed not to be able to be there. And finally, I'd like to apologize to BDS and the staff in particular, to my head coach Striker, who will always be a person that I greatly appreciate and who my his story has fundamentally changed anything between me and him. I'm a very competitor. My anger issues are a result of that. Nevertheless, I try to be a better human every day, and that's why BS has chosen to continue this this year because the monster described in this article is simply not me. Yeah, I think this is a bit overblown. The way this is written. I think he just got benched for flaming the coach and the coach flaming him or some shit. I don't know. I don't think he actually, like, fucking attacked his, his teammates. All right, what else? Offline chatters based. <laughs> yeah, I did write that. Happy Valentine's Day. I love you, baby. Rat face. So now, are you giving that to me or did someone give you that to you? Can we get XTD smolder? No, we definitely can't. Okay, we can get it. It looks so fucking degenerate. I like it. Mirwin XTD. Chat. And my, my browser crashed.
Yeah, chat, stop getting banned in the LEC chat. Stop writing there. Look at you all. Two things happen from this. One, Riot will probably come to me and say, hey, your fans are being, or your streamer watchers are being complete degenerates. Can you do something about it? Like, we're not very happy with this. And the other thing that can happen is everyone's just going to spam, casual fans are cringe. So there's no win here, chat. Just stop spamming. Please stop it. Stop it. Uh, otherwise, I'm going to be like, I'm going to get in trouble and I'm going to have to start cross banning shit. I don't want to cross ban, but I might have to. Yeah, I might have to chill. And today I'll be streaming, so don't worry, you don't have to go there. You don't have to fucking spam there. Evil Cage will be like, he just completed it. Huh? Look at you. Then stream next time. Okay, so it's my fault for not streaming. Just found K Corp's new roster. What is that Twitter account? K Corp Cajrel. When does Fnatic play? Are you high? What is that account, bro? Are you dumb? What is wrong with you? This video was generated by Sora, an AI model that can create videos from text prompts. This video below was 100% created by Sora. Prompt in game, a League of Legends man flashes over the wall and cancels his mouth. Oh. One in the tower is oh. as well. Ready to take a fight. Flash over. How do you... Just cancelled. Wait. That was all. Cajal just cancelled it. He has. With it, Maywin's going to look for the tier one in the bot lane. Let's have another. Let's look, look at this Cassante champ. Kept at arm's length by Maywin this entire time. Yeah, I mean, brings him over the wall. There's nothing that Shao can do. And the everyone on BDS is just trying to catch up, but he's so slippery. Yeah, even having the ghost. <laughs> he wrote XDD in chat. <laughs> Slash all XDD. That's what he wrote. <laughs> Slash all XDD. What a, what a, a little bit of personality into your gameplay. That's how you do it. Merwin with the XDD didn't see if he sent it. Could have deleted it. It could have. It could have just been a type control yeah. A. And Watching any CLK okay just made me realize. Realize what? How much more fun and enjoyable the costumes are. Before Kajal, I just watched the match on Old Spot, turning in and out, going on my phone until a big fight happens. But with Kajal, streams are so much more energy and hype and analysis. And the rat community is really funny. I'm not stuck on the caster, just find Kajal's main side more understanding. Yeah, that's all I have to say. Thanks, Kajal, for making Lini Sports fun to watch. You say this, but then the chatters are saying, like, you say, like, oh, you're. You. I'm, I appreciate that you like the analysis and stuff. But, bro, if I say anything, people are just going to take what I say and be like, la 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 la. You know, like, oh, I think T1 have like a 15% chance to win this game. And then they win a team fight and win the game. And everyone's like, 15%? Ha ha, ha ha, ha ha Mirwin. Wait, what the fuck? Isn't that Ralph from The Simpsons? <laughs> Shut the fuck up. I saw this as well, chat. I saw this. I saw this. Look, look at this. This is actually kind of funny. Fuck, man. I love my viewership when fucking Kato doesn't stream. Maybe I should kidnap him. <laughs> Hello. Maybe I should kidnap him. <laughs> Faker's wrist aware? Was he doing this? Uh... Is he okay? What the fuck? He's still having wrist problems by the looks of it. Maybe it's just to like stretch it out or something? I don't know if it's still hurting or not. When, when was that? Was that recently? I guess it was, right? That's their uniform. Hmm. I don't know. I don't think that's a stretch, though. He wants to grab the mic, maybe? I don't know. I can't really tell. And then he does grab the mic, but then he does chooses against it. And puts his hand behind his back. Hmm. Former world champion Juhan has reached an agreement with Giant X Academy. What? Is that the most random thing ever? How has Juhan gone to the LVP? <laughs> what? He just won Worlds last year, or the two years ago. <laughs> I mean, he didn't really play. 